Welcome to day 55. Have you done the math to know how many miles you've got? Oh yeah, Port Clinton was 502 miles. <laughs> yeah, 500 miles! Woo! Yeah. 500 miles, congratulations! Yeah. You must feel pretty accomplished. Feels great, yep. Mm. Looking for 525 or whatever it is that you get the- The quarter. Quarter, quarter, yeah. quarter of the way. Is we'll get that soon. really soon, yeah. yeah. But now we're gonna get a breakfast. Yay. Tilly's hat has had, well, some issues. It spent a little too long in a washing machine and now it's got a rather unique brim. So last night after I washed it, put it under the bed and I'm about to yank it out and see what happened. Very little improvement, <laughs> but maybe a little. Okay, until they open a door. So. Oh, okay. Well, that's, I didn't even ask. Hi, Gertrash. Sorry, I don't know why I've, I've heard your name. Yeah. <laughs>
Today was a zero in Hamburg, Pennsylvania. Boy, for a zero, we got a lot of stuff done. Yeah, last night as we were putting our heads on our pillow, we thought, how lucky are we that uh, Mrs. Rock Flipper had come to town and was gonna drive us all around and we'd get to resupply and that'd be so easy. And then we started looking over our gear and we realized that his trekking pole had broken. We'd lost a couple little things. The belt on my backpack had was completely worn out. We both needed new shoes. Shoes were trashed. Our socks, we were thinking, oh, we need to get new socks. And pretty soon we got a, a text from Expedition Director M, and apparently she had run the algorithm and already figured out that we needed resupply. But we told her we were fine, and we went to sleep. And when we woke up this morning, we came to the realization that, of course, she was right. M is always right. M is always right. So we humbly requested um, a, a change in our answer and asked her to, to go ahead and come up and resupply us. So she drove three hours for us today. She packed up the dogs, grabbed all our resupply, drove all the way up here, and then shuttled us around to do a little more resupply and shopping in town. Yeah, so we got to, to snuggle the girlies, and we got to, I got to go to Cabela's and Walmart, which was fun, and we got some big meals, which was nice, uh, but most of all, we got all those bits and pieces we need. Uh, you know, you just can't replace your shoes with any old brand, and uh, so it was nice that she brought us our spare pairs. So we're here in Hamburg with, I don't know, probably a dozen other hikers. Oh yeah, at least a dozen. Everybody has come in for a zero or uh, to come in for the weekend. Some new sectioners, some through hikers, some flip floppers, um, but but the hotel's doing a great job of, you know, keeping everybody kind of separated and, and they've got food service out of their pub, so there's a great place to grab a drink or get something to eat. So the microtels turned out to be a really good place to land. Yeah, but it's there's definitely a bubble when you combine all the people that went ahead and through hikes starting in late February, early March, and then kept going. We each have all the people who came back out like us, and then all the people who were doing a flip flop starting in Harper's Ferry. They're all converging right now in about the same area. So we've got a real, real heat map, a real bubble going on right now in Hamburg. Yeah, so hopefully over the next several days as people start hiking their own speeds and distances, it'll all kind of spread out a little bit. But, well, most of us are headed north. <laughs> it is what we do. Um, it's, been a, it's been a fun day. Um, yeah. The Cabela's in Hamburg is probably the biggest one in the country. Um, I was just trying to get in and out and pick up one, one thing and um, Man, it's like walking through Disneyland and just trying to get like one food item and then walk right, right back out. It's, uh, it's an incredible stop. And then the Walmart here is really large too. So I think I walked about four or five miles today, but all of it was indoors. But we're resupplied, we're retuned, we're healed a little bit, ready to hit the road. Yep. Thanks for joining us.